hello and welcome back to my channel today i have several valentine's diy i hope you enjoy it taking this wooden round from dollar tree along with this brass rings i am going to go ahead and use white chalk paint and paint everything in white I'm recycling this. This is a tap to a uh, liquor bottle. I'm going to be painting this white as well along with these Jenga blocks. And now that everything is completely painted and dry, I'm going to start hot gluing this tap to this wooden plank. Just like you see right here. And then I have these tiles, they're mirror tiles. I got this at Dollar Tree. I'm going to start cutting two rolls of them and I'm going to start gluing them on the wooden round along with that liquor bottle top. And although that the um, tiles have their own adhesive, I am going to go ahead and add some hot glue just to secure it for a long term. So now I'm going to take the Jenga blocks and put two and two. This is going to sandwich in the rings and that's what's going to hold it so it can stay standing up. You'll see. I hope I'm making sense. I'm also going to uh, glue with, uh, of course, some hot glue. I'm going to glue all three together so like that they won't move. And now I'm going to go ahead and put some more mirror tiles on top of the Jenga blocks. I got these heart ornaments from Dollar Tree. I'm going to take two of them. Now that gold doesn't match, so I'm going to paint it in white with this chalk paint. Now that it's completely dry, I'm going to put them back together to the ornament. And once that is done, I have some pearls necklace that I bought at uh, Amazon. I'm going to go ahead and hot glue it to the top and that's how I'm going to hang it to the brass ring. And this is the way DIY number one turned out. I hope you enjoy it. I really like this DIY, especially the bottom part with all the mirrors. I think it looks nice and classy. Comment in the comment section and let me know what you think about this DIY. Taking this white vase from Dollar Tree and this ribbon also from Dollar Tree. They have little hearts on top and in the bottom. I also got this last year from Michaels. I will be using the beads. They come in white, pink, and red. I'm going to string them with this jew twine and then I'm going to tie it to the top of this vase and i also have this little heart that came in a big bag full of all kinds of uh wood goodies from dollar tree
this is how it's looking all together I have a little pillar and I just put the vase on top just to make it look a little bit taller I hope you enjoy this simple DIY I believe it's beautiful in my eyes but comment and let me know what you think about this DIY these wooden beads that I will be painting with this red acrylic paint and once that is uh, completed I have more wooden beads that I'm going to be painting with this chalk white paint I took this heart and I painted it in red with the same acrylic red paint I'm making a hole only because I'm going to be taking that jute one and I am going to be tying it and I am going to be making a garland. Just keep watching. I mean, there's nothing to this. This is the final look of this garland. Comment in the comment section and let me know what you think about this beautiful Valentine's garland. Using this heart vase from Dollar Tree, I'm going to take two of these candles also from Dollar Tree and I'm going to put it for five minutes in the microwave. This is how it looks so far. I also have this glittery ribbon. I'm going to be cutting it and putting it on both borders, on top and in the bottom. And here they are all put together. I want to thank you for sticking around until the end of my video. If you are still here, you are a pro. You made it all the way to the end. Also, if you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. The subscription is completely free. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Share it with your families and friends so like that they can also enjoy my videos. And then I will be able to see you in my next one. You take care. Adios.